welcome back to the channel today we are looking at how to level up piloting very very quickly and very easily without any trouble whatsoever but before we get into it make sure you hit that like button subscribe and all of that fun youtube stuff so to level up piloting means that you get to be able to fly ships with a higher class so most ships that you start with are like level a reactor type a and they're the most basic ships but you want like b and eventually c as you can see right here for me i've got you know the shield breaker that i bought from the ship guy really really good powerful ship to have and i've only just got piloting up because i just couldn't be bothered before but it is way better than most of the other ships that i have this i can't wait to use the dragon fire but i need to get to rank four to get to c and the way that you do this is by obviously putting skill points into piloting now you can see the challenge progress down in the bottom left for me right now is destroy 30 ships above that i think it was destroy 15 and i think the first rank to rank two was five so 5 15 30 and i'm assuming probably 50 to 100 for the last one but it actually is very easy to level up. So if you go to New Atlantis and you fly to the Mast District or the Lodge, because the Lodge is in the Mast District, you want to follow exactly where I'm going. So you're going to go ahead into like the big main building where the, you join the, the colonies and loads of different things happen in this place. But it is the tutorial area as well. And in that tutorial area, you can get into a flight simulator. So if you head into this office area and you go up the lift, you can use the lift to get to this flight simulator. You go into the flight simulator and you will be able to fight a whole bunch of ships. And every time you kill one of these ships with the powerful ships that they give you, you will add on to your progress of leveling up piloting. I haven't exactly counted how many ships you get in one run, but it's it's a good enough amount. You go through different tiers of six levels altogether. You'll fight like one ship on the first tier, two or three on the second tier, four, five or six on the third tier. Then you go back to like one because it's a much higher level. So it's a bit more difficult. And then you go back to like two or three and then like six again. So there's a whole bunch of ships here and it's very easy to kill them all without dying whatsoever. But even if you die, you lose nothing. You just leave the flight simulator, turn around and go back in. So even if you wanted to go up to only rank three, where it's re really, really easy to get, you'll probably get about 10 or so ships. You can leave and re-enter and then go get another 10 ships. So just make sure that you have the skill points to spend beforehand because if you get to rank 2 and you need to destroy 15 ships and you destroy those 15 ships but you don't have the skill point to level up piloting, that means that all of the progress you make after that will not count. You need to be at that rank for it to start counting on the next rank. So once you hit rank 2, go back to this flight simulator, get to rank 3, leave, get yourself a skill point and then come back and do it all again for rank 4. Not only will this give you the chance to fly better ships, but it also allows you to build better ships that you can fly. So if you're really into thinking about building ships and making the most badass thing that you can do, this is going to be very helpful for you to get early because then you can build better and better ships at a higher level so that you can use it and have fun. Just a quick little tip for those who don't know yet. It's very, very useful. I've been using it and I just need to get a few skill points before I finish it up. So if it helped, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe if you're new around here, leave me a comment down below. Thank you for watching. I've been easy now. You guys have been awesome.